the first thing I have to do today is to stop by the lab. Technically, I'm working from home this week and going to next week, but when you're maintaining cells, like for me, I'm maintaining um, insect cells, you have to go in to make sure they're healthy and they're alive because without them, you can't express protein. If you can't express protein, then you can't do any of the experiments that may be lined up for you. After lab, I'll come straight home to work on some illustration and figure work for a paper that I'm participating in the writing process for. In the evening, I have a meeting to attend. I'm actually pretty excited for this one because a colleague will be running a mock lecture. I told her I'd love to be a part of it, so I'm gonna drop in and see how that goes. That's all for the agenda wrap-up. Right now, it's already 10 o'clock. I did not expect to get ready this late. But yeah, here I am. Okay, I need to go. just got back and I have seven minutes to spare before I have to join in on my meeting well I just got back from lab and I'm gonna like eat with the camera off so yeah sorry okay. I'll be hiding yeah. okay <laughs> Thanks for um, doing this though. yeah no problem thank you for inviting me That was really good. And then now, I'm just looking forward to chilling the rest of the night. It's about four o'clock. Miso okay. gets neglected whenever I'm working, which, you know, makes sense. I can't play with her and work at the same time. After work, it's like Miso time. I try to take her out, go to the dog park, or just like play with her for a little bit, make her find food, <laughs> like find the treat. I'll probably go and do that. Whoa, whoa, what's that? No, come back! Miso! <laughs> huh? What'd you find, huh? Oh, squirrel went off the tree? Nah, too slow. Come on, we gotta go. <laughs> Oi. Come on, yeah! <laughs> Wow, you're so good.
I'm back. It's been a hot minute. Excuse you. <laughs> I'm speaking. Her tail was wagging. <laughs> Last night was really bad because Miso had diarrhea all night and I had to get up four times between three and eight o'clock to take her out. She seems to be doing better now. I am pretty tired, but I'm gonna try to get some work done. And by work, and by work, I mean doing some reading that I was supposed to do and prepare a presentation for. Yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be uh, a long night. <laughs> All right, I'm going to show you how I take notes, especially when reading a scientific paper and, and how I put together a presentation for it. Usually I have it downloaded as a PDF file and then I would just highlight as I go along and then make notes by typing it up in the PowerPoint that I will be presenting on down here in the notes. But for my own sake, I really do feel like I need to learn how to utilize my iPad more. So then <laughs> I've decided just to work on the iPad. Time to eat dinner. Just some salmon teriyaki with rice and a bunch of seaweed paper. the raw data to be honest this is still like a little bit filtered data because raw data was like it was like really difficult to see and Examination. She still has diarrhea, very mucusy diarrhea for four or five days. And I'm here reading and waiting. It's kind of late to start my second paper, but I'm reading it now. <laughs> this is one that I've read before. I already have a PowerPoint ready for it, so I'm just gonna reread it, refresh my memory, and then go over the old PowerPoint again later tonight when I rehearse it for tomorrow. So today's Thursday, which means I have to go to lab to split my cells and do a few lab duties, which include polymerizing more actin filaments for a um, for someone in a different lab who's also working on myosin, we're providing reagents and everything he needs to successfully run his experiments. After that, I will be on my way home and just finish this dang paper that I've been talking about all week, literally, and just brush up. Actually, not even brush up. I have to go through my PowerPoint. It's pretty bad. I get anxious every time I have to present. But yeah, I will be presenting tomorrow. After that, I'm just gonna call it a weekend, relax and not do anything because it's uh, it's been a rough week <laughs> with me so being sick. I'm just glad that tomorrow's Friday.
these are the cells I'm keeping alive. One is a new stock and then the other one is a stock that I'm keeping for myself. This is my lazy dinner tonight. Oh, I need to finish this PowerPoint. exhibit any kind of dimerization or higher order uh, formation as opposed to the myosin 6 without the liposome. So to start off, DAB2 and GIPC are both myosin binding partners and adapter proteins that are found on clathrin coated structures at a 10% composition of PIP2 in a liposome mixture. This was when it bound to myosin the most. And then we had decided that, you know, we were going to survive this. And I know the other thing that's going on, the was involved in it, is we have all the figures pretty much wrapped up for this paper. All right, just finished my presentation and finished our group meeting, which was good. Now my weekend finally starts. Mm -hmm.